The first trophy of the season is just a couple of wins away. Bellion. Oh, it's gone right through the keeper. Cinema Pong goal! Liverpool are through! Stop! Breakthrough! Liverpool has won it! Manchester United couldn't beat Exeter at home on Saturday. How would they do at Stamford Bridge? Chelsea don't want last four, they want all four. Trophies, that is. He's won a few, but he's won a few more, and he wants to settle a champion. It started with a handshake. Two heavyweight clubs, but this is a catchweight contest. Manchester United are wheeling out only the light artillery. Chelsea intend to give it the full barrage. Given that Ian Robin is suspended, Mourinho makes only one concession, with Cudicini replacing Czech in goal. Otherwise, it's what's perceived to be Chelsea's first team, so Ida Jonsson, who got the winner when these sides met here on the Premiership's opening day, gets the nod over Didier Drogba. In contrast, Sir Alec Ferguson has left behind as many first-teamers as he's brought. However, Saha, O'Shea and Fortune return from injury, and Wayne Rooney is back after his three-match ban to add a wild-card element to the United selection. Chelsea are now priced at only 16-1 to 1 to win all four available trophies. But Manchester United can equal them in terms of durability. Both sides have lost just twice in their last 32 matches. Chelsea playing from the right in the first half. That's Lampard. His pass cut out by Ainsé. And now Claude Makélélé shielding it from Eric Jemba Jemba. Firm challenge again from the Argentine Ainsé. This is Gallas this time who goes down. It is a free kick. Jim Beglin knows what it's like to play in a League Cup semi-final. Two contrasting lineups. What's the key area? Well, I think midfield uh, for United. I think a lot depends on what sort of impact that quartet can make. I think without its big hitters, that department has to deliver. Nice and alert and tight to Chelsea because Jose Mourinho's selection says a trophy as soon as possible, please. And of course they start firm favourites. Here's Quentin Fortune, that's overhit. And not even the dexterous Rooney can keep it in. Liverpool away coming up on Saturday morning. This is Ronaldo. Set Bridge into a spin. Now Fletcher. All the way across to Luis Saha. Who's faced by Paolo Ferreira. And then he goes down, but rather hurled himself, and the referee just with a quick shake of the head says a decisive no. Now Joe Cole. Duck with an injection of pace. And back came Philip Neville. It is a free kick. Well, it was a great ball from Fletcher to find Saha to begin with. I thought he was looking for it far too easily. A little bit of contact from Thiago. Both players are actually wagging their fingers. I agree with Neil Barry. Not for me. John Terry, such a threat at set pieces as six goals this season will tell you. And Damien Duff with his left foot whips these in pretty tellingly. There's Lampard over there as well, but it is Duff. And Phil Neville was in the way. Lampard. Terry. Now good Jonsson. Touch was heavy off the chest. And Sylvester is able to scramble it away. Thiago, Joe Cole, in came O'Shea very rapidly. Fletcher. So Ronaldo ahead of him and to his right. Sahar is through the middle. Rooney is out on the left flank in plenty of space. Fletcher to Saha. And nearly squeezed it past Terry. Lovely touch by Joe Cole. This is his stage tonight. Big game, big occasion. Here's Duff. And Duff has a goal! And it would have been a goal to grace a special occasion. Well, Tim Howard seemed to react very comfortably to it, but judging by Damien Duff's reaction, it was a lot closer. It looked 
I mean, he struck it really, really well. That was very, very close. And I think Howard's getting absolutely nowhere near that. Completely caught out by it. It's a good, good try. Terry. Fletcher. Rooney's touch for Saha. And now Ronaldo. And Rooney's lurking by the penalty spot, but this is Ronaldo. Now, did he have his feet taken from beneath him? The referee says no again. Joe Cole, who's full of tricks, still has two to beat. Oh, awful. Fortune. Offside given against Rooney. Well, Alex Ferguson must be feeling now we should have had one. I'm just wondering whether John Terry actually tries to play Ronaldo here. He slides in. I think he's already, I think Ronaldo slips into it and then makes a meal of it. I think the referee's got it right in both counts. Thiago. Full of flicks and tricks, Joe Cole. And then a late challenge by Cole, who's come off the worse with Jemba Jemba. There's just a suggestion that there might have been a stamp in that. Well, Thiago showed too much of the Sylvester. It was a good challenge by him. And Cole has put himself about tonight. Now, he caught him a little bit, and that was very, very naughty by Jemba Jemba. And he's lucky that wasn't seen, because he should be in the book for that, if not worse. Well, he's up, but grimacing. Time was when Peter Kenyon would have been found in the red corner tonight. Multiple choice question. How many penalties should Manchester United have had? One, two, or none? Well, do you know, when I look at it again there, it, it looked more a penalty than first off. This one, now Terry doesn't play him, and I think Ronaldo slips. The first one, maybe. Thiago. Ready to Paolo Ferreira. Cole's in the middle, so it's Damien Duff. And Duff was in traffic, and Phil Neville clears. It was heavy traffic. Ferreira. Lampard! Tim Howard wasn't getting on that either. Good ball in second time round. I mean, I think it was John O'Shea got a very important touch in all of this when it first comes in. It's, it's great width been provided. John O'Shea there. That was needed, and Ferreira again, I think, gets another very good delivery in. And Lampard, well, just a whisker away again. Howard was beaten, all ends up. Neville's throw. Run by the domineering Terry. Ronaldo. Solidly done by Lampard. Neville's throw. Returned with interest by Terry. Cole. Heide Good Johnson. Lampard, shooting opportunity is semi blocked by Sylvest. And then miscued by O'Shea. And that's offside. Good Johnson's offside, it won't count. From Duff's driven cross. Bernard Baker, the referee's assistant, was right in line. It's a big sigh of relief for John O'Shea because of this. You know, it's not a competent header, and it's a good call because he's clearly in an offside position when Duff fires it back across goal. But most of the chances are now coming Chelsea's way. Rooney. Cole. Jemba Jemba tracking back with him. And having another bite, and the flag is up once more. Just as well for Eidegger Johnson this time, because he didn't know. I, I mean, I think Joe Cole's tackle here epitomises why. He was just offside as well, Eidegger Johnson. I think, again, the assistant gets it right.
Rooney. Terry, Wayne Rooney! And this will carry a threat, however much pressure they're having to soak up. I think Gallus could have reacted quicker to this. You know, he backed off it, and Terry had to come all the way across. I think it might have taken a nick off Gallus on the way out as well, because Rooney did appeal for a corner. words Makaleli is alleging the use of the elbow by Ainsé well, the Argentinian does use it a lot and, um, I was giving him the benefit of the doubt once upon a time but he, I, he usually does that he feels for the player and gives him a little elbow and, and it's certainly evident again then a Buenos Aires kiss Jim one of those O'Shea to Fletcher. Saha, Ronaldo. Still are too much on it for Luis Saha. 